Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're playing once more Final Fantasy 3. And why you ask? Because I did some snooping around and tried some different things and I'm way too late to start recording because it's actually interesting. But we have retrieved a pendant from Princess Sarah uh, that we have to get fixed by a certain blacksmith. And when we looked at Mognet using uh, Rufia, we got a message from her uh, from her uh, adoptive father which told us about a legendary blacksmith so we're going to find that blacksmith right now this isn't part of the official thing this is just gonna join in as an extra episode to show you some secrets in this game but yeah I uh I missed a lot of things, so... Let's fly off the continent. And let's go find the blacksmith, which I think, if I remember correctly, there was a shop in Seronia. So let's see if we can actually uh, get into Seronia again. Should be around... Yes. Right, so it's in one of these villages. Northwest. I mean, don't know if that's the one, but sure, let's check it out. Hmm. Okay, um, I had an epiphany, and I think um, this place is not yet able to find this. So what I'm going to do is actually I'm going to go back to uh, the place where Taka is. Let's see if we can get it repaired by him. Yes, we are. We're too far. Oh, there we are. Okay. Now, where was Taka again? I guess in one of the starting villages. Yeah, it should be here. Alright. Causes. Um, should be in here. Yes, okay. Back so soon, is your journey done, or is there something I can do for you? The princess of Castle Sassuna gave us this pendant, it's broken. Let me see now. Hmm, I have no idea what this is made of. I've never seen anything like it. Okay, I guess I'll have to find someone else. Right, so if we, um... Talk to the Mog... Uh, I already got this message, but yeah, I told you, but there's supposed to be this legendary smith wandering in the world. Rumors has it that she fixes things so well, they look brand new, yeah. Yeah. I will have to go find him. I guess we lock ourselves in. <laughs> can we work around this? Yes, we can. Okay. Okay, so where is that smith gonna be?
So this is northwest, right? Um. Oh, is that her? I'm a smith traveling the world in search of legendary material metals. You are the master smith, are you not? I have a favor to ask you. This pendant, can you fix it? it? Belongs to someone very dear to me. I will do anything you ask if you can restore it to its previous state. I wouldn't do this normally, but I like the look in your eyes. Let me see this pendant of yours. There, it's all fixed. Alright, so we got the pendant back. What amount of kill would be sufficient for your work? Money does not interest me. There is one item, however, that I would like to ask. Have you ever heard of Oricalcum? Alright, this is, this is a message that we also got. So if we can find the mog in here, is there a mog in here? No, but oh well. Um. All right, let's uh, go return the pendant first. This should be sufficient. already went too far again. Let's enter from this side. Then Kazus is all the way over there. Okay. There we go. Fixed. If I may ask, what did that pendant mean to you? It is a keepsake. The pendant belonged to my mother. Thank you, Angus, everyone. You can't imagine how much this means to me. Oh, you're welcome. Now let's go to the town where Sid is. It should be right here. Canaan, okay. Talk to the Mog. Alright, so Sid has a new thing saying something in the basement. Mrs. Sid came running up from the basement today, all scared. She says she saw something big lurking in the shadow. So let's go find out what that is. To Sid's house. And I believe that is this one? No. Wrong again. Sid's house. There we go. Ah, nice of you to come. As you know, a monster is set a permanent residence in our basement. Alright, so how do I get into the basement? <laughs> um, did I go too fast? Where is the basement entrance? Uh... Oh, okay. There we go. Let's go see what's in his basement. Some chests. Iron arrows. Alright. Oh, there's a monster. But isn't that... 
No, you gotta be kidding me. Isn't that the... What's his name again? <laughs> Look there. Prepare to be exterminated. I mean, it looks the same like the, the one guy we defeated. Oh, well, let's just do what we always do. Kick its ass. Oh, wow, well, that went fast. I guess coming here after we beat the game pretty much uh, left us with nothing important. There's something on the floor. I've never seen metal like this mentioned in any books before. Well, we got the unknown metal. Why can't we run up here? Oh, okay. Secret to more chests. Good to know. Okay. So what now? Your basement certified pest free, Sid. Find it. It's a piece of metal that the monster dropped. Well, I'll be. It's Oracalcum, a very rare metal indeed. Alright, so do we just take it back to her? I'm guessing she will be in a different place. Let's see where it is. I remember, I think that was close to Seronia, so I'm gonna check that out. Is that it? I don't think she's here. What else can we see from here? What's this? No. So, I figured I was using the wrong ship, so, uh, yeah. I think this is the place. Yeah, that's, uh, more like it. Alright, so... There you are. Hello. Is this what you were looking for? Yes, yes, that is unmistakably Oricalcum. I didn't think I'd ever lay eyes on it. Thanks for bringing it to me. Mind if I start working on it? Go for it. is going to be quite the challenge indeed. Ding, 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 ding. All right, I was expecting you. I've succeeded in tempering or recalcum. The result is by best work yet, if I may say so myself. Here it is, yours. The Ultima weapon. All right, so let's see if it's actually a good weapon. Alright, so if you want to find her, I believe she's just going to roam the world, so... 
let's look if it's actually a better sword than the Masamune. It is. It is better. Alright. Um, now, let's talk to the Morg again. We have not received all letters from them. Hmm. Alright, can I... Do you have something new for me now? Alice, alright. So we have the Nautilus. How has the Nautilus served to you so far? Hmm... I'm gonna look into why this isn't completing. So, um, yeah, uh, she left before I could record it, but yeah, we got this from um, the blacksmith when you found her again. Uh, so the bearer of this certificate wields an ultimate control over the healing arts and is deemed worthy of the title of Master Devote. So, yeah, I think that's for Rufia, because she is a healer. Yeah, we're gonna, like, continuously switch between these places to keep finding her. She's not there. It's kind of funny that you can just... Bounce around between these places to find them. The only annoying part is that you constantly have to walk in there. And she's not there. Yeah, this is gonna take a while. There we go, we found her again. Uh, we have a Master Magus, so uh, we can have this in Singa, yeah, the Magus card. And then, in addition, I will give you this in praise of your achievements. A Millennium Rod, so we can give that to um, Ark. But she will disappear every time you do this. But if you want to get the equipment, like, the good equipment, you gotta, you gotta keep doing this. If I'm lucky, well, she will be in here, but yeah, I don't know. Nope. Let's try this again. Nope. just put it on when I find her again. So, um, I took the time to look at this. Uh, we got the fourth uh, message from the, the four old man. So, I wonder if he switched to Ark. We will get a new message from the king. We do. Okay. 
There is an old legend in Saronia that speaks of a star falling into the sea, creating a great wave that swallowed the evils of the world. Alright, let's, uh, let's go check this out. Off the continent we go. Hmm. Aha. There it is. This is what I've been trying to do. I, uh, I read some things online about this, and, uh, yeah. You're in for a treat. Let's, uh, let's save our game. Because you never know in these places. Now, what is this? Ooh. Question marks everywhere. Okay. Okay, okay. Who cares? There's nothing here. Forget it. Let's get out of here. Oh, Loneth behind you. You're too big to sneak on people like that. <laughs> so, I believe... Um, Oh, let's not go ahead of ourselves. The Iron Giant, that's his name, alright. Let's make sure we can win this. Because I believe this will be painful. Yes, it is very painful. I don't think we will win this on the first try. I don't think so. <laughs> Alright, it's been a while, but uh, here is a... What's it called? Where are they? Phoenix down, yay. Alright, so his melee is doing literally nothing. I think we lost. I think it's fair to say we lost, yeah. Okay. The party has been defeated. Let's try this again in... Uh, in the future, but yeah, I'll see you in a second. So, before we actually go and try that again, um, I learned something. I learned something. Where's the papa? Is this the papa? No. Oh, try using a potion on you. Oh, there you go. I don't have a normal potion anymore. <laughs> it's impossible for me. You the papa? No, you're not the papa. This is the papa. Thank you for coming. It seems the children have gone into the altar cave. Could you go look for them? Aha! Aha! Seems like we have some unfinished business back in the altar cave. Now, what's this? There they are. I don't like the looks of this. <laughs> Ready to one-shot everything. Because apparently this was something you should have done, like, right after you beat Gut Skull. That's a long time ago. <laughs> it's just... just... yeah. Everything just gets one-shotted, uh, no matter how much damage you do. Alright, so I should teach you. Hey Ark, we found this, but you can have it. A crystal fragment, you now can change jumps to the Onion Knight. So this is probably what we will need to be able to actually um, get that. Also this place holds uh, a lot of chests for us. Right, so what's with the hole? I think this takes us back to uh, where we can find the, the original crystal. Yeah, I think that's just 
our way back. All right, how weak are these gonna be? <laughs> oh boy. All right, just, just let me be in peace. <laughs> what experience? That's that's just too cute. All right, let's uh turn into this. And uh, yeah, I will see you all in probably 24 hours, which is going to be uh, seconds in recording time. But yeah, see you soon. Okay, so uh, we are here in the cave with the Iron Giant. And we have gathered all the gear that we needed. And that literally took seven days. So um, yeah, this better be working. It's a big boy. Alright, let's uh let's try and get him down on a slow pace. It doesn't matter if it takes longer. Alright, so magic doesn't do anything, man. Alright, so and the damage I got from him before is is halved, so I should be able to withstand some stuff. on healing everybody and you attack normally all right everybody full again I wonder how, uh, how strong this thing actually is It really seems like not much is happening to his, like, damage or anything. I'm gonna try and do Flare on him and see if that does anything more than uh, the normal attacks. Oh, it does good damage, okay. I'm gonna keep doing flare with her. I'm gonna see if there's other magic I can do with uh, Luna Thuringus. Because that could definitely be a good thing. Alright, so I've only learned in. Drain and then Thandaga. You can do what I had set for you, you can do that too, and then you. Oh, I didn't teach you any good things, did I? I don't know if that's gonna do more than a melee, but we'll see. Oh, it does, okay. Then we'll keep doing magic attacks. I wonder if this will keep working. This is going to take a while, I think.
Okay, I'm gonna switch up uh, Rufius and Duraja, because uh, I feel like I'm wasting too much for that. Never sleep enough for that. Whoa, 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 what's that? What was that? You're not allowed to do new things. Wait, hold on. Uh, do I have elixirs? Did I already go past him? Probably. Yes, there they are. Get Arc and Elixir. You do whatever you were doing. And yeah. Do that, because it's going to be necessary. That's such a painful thing. Doing what you're doing. <laughs> oh boy. The flares are doing good damage down. There we go. There we go. Holy damn. Steely Resolve. Achievement unlocked. There we fucking go. Oh my god. <laughs> what was that thing? Anyway. It certainly was a beast. Perhaps it is connected to the shooting star that King Ella spoke of. Doesn't matter. We beat it. Yes, we did. I guess we're getting stronger. I do not think I could have faced such a thing and lived when I was in Sasune. Come on, our journey awaits. We obtained the metal card. And with that... Oh man, I'm so happy with this. Uh, let me just look at that. Look at that. What beautiful thing. The bearer of this metal card has ever come and conquered what can only be called the greatest challenge the world has ever known. So, um, yeah, I think this is... Uh, proof that we beat the most difficult boss in this game now without further ado guys i want to thank you all so much for watching uh this was uh this this one took a long time to make so uh, i hope you all enjoyed um but yeah be sure to check out my twitch uh we stream there almost every day uh feel free to check out my discord as well it's totally free to join and uh you'll meet a lot of nice people there and uh be sure to click that bell to get notified when a, a new upload goes on uh new uploads also get posted in discord but that's totally to you and without further ado i will see you all in the next video <laughs>